But yeah, she does get her presence known in the front of the center. Received by the Gophers up to Caroline Barnes. Serve as there's a kill there for Lauren Crowell, the red shirt freshman from Egan, Minnesota. So 4-2 lead early here for the Gophers in the first set. Served by Rachel Kilkelly. And Burbage will take a swing at it. Received by the Gophers. And there's a kill for Carter Booth. Pretty aggressive serve by Terry. She's very good at that, as we mentioned earlier. 0.43 aces per set leads the Big Ten in that category. But Minnesota picks up the kill there off Shaftmaster. Sakota back in the game trying to with the serve there. And that's going to be a kill there for Jenna Wenis. Which is something they'll really want to get up if they want to compete in this match here. As there's a spike down by Erica David. he will stay serving for the Gophers. There's Nunji. And that one was hit on the way down by Booth. Mosier want, took a swing at it, but it was blocked down low by Wenis, it looked like. They have Nunji, they have Terry, and being able to take advantage that Brooks hot right now, that she's able to get the kill. That was gonna be hard to get to for the Illini. Being able to get the perfect pass and lead to that transition by Booth. Here's Collins, and the blocking presence up front of Carter Booth with Shaftmaster to her side, and Minnesota picks up three straight points to take a 13-11 lead. Been kind of quiet on the blocking uh, in this third set. As here's Collins, but no, Carter Booth is right there to send it back to the Illini side.